All right, when we picture potatoes on our Thanksgiving table, maybe we normally think of creamy, mashed, mm. and topped with gravy, oh, right? Oh, that sounds great. But Chef Crystal Baldwin is here to shake up tradition with a whole new take on these spuds featuring eggs and mustard and pickles, and you can smell the savory goodness in here. You're speaking straight to Pittsburgh's heart, Chef Crystal. What's on the menu today? So it's a roasted potato salad. Ooh. Yeah. So um, I love warm potato salads. Mm -hmm. It's mm -hmm. really nice, and it's a super simple one. It's a little elevated, you know? although it's super simple. So um, what I have, I have potatoes. And if you're not that adventurous, I brought maybe two thirds of the types of potatoes that we have in you the have store. You have so many potatoes. <laughs> so many potatoes. So if you like potatoes. There still yeah. are potatoes left in the store. Uh, yeah. I know, it seemed like I wiped it out, right? So but what lots kind of different do you varieties. use? I have a golden potato. Okay. You want something that can hold up to bacon and maybe it's a little bit waxy. Uh, so that would be like a red skin, a golden potato, okay. fingerling, something like that, okay? okay? Not an Idaho because it will break apart too easily and it will soak up a lot of oil. Got it. Okay. Those are great for a know. lot of things, right? Good to know. So I have that potato, and then what we're gonna do is we're gonna throw some oil on there, and then some salt and pepper, and we're gonna roast this in a 425 degree oven. So I'm gonna take and put it on a sheet tray and put it in a single layer. And how right? long are these roasting for? It's about 25 minutes, okay. somewhere around there, till they're nice and brown. And I have some over here, right? Yeah, we these just saw look them great. Come out they tray. came out on a tray. Great. So, and this recipe, it makes a small amount, but that's nice because if you don't have a lot of people in the family, you make a little bit, but then you can definitely make a lot and it's if easy, you want to. right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. So you guys are gonna make the salad, right? Ooh, oh, fun. Yeah. Okay, so we have a so, big bowl. In that bowl, you're gonna take and put your eggs in there. Okay, just okay. like this? Yep, just like that. And you have a fork. You're gonna take your fork over there and you're gonna take and kind of mash it up a little bit. Oh. Do you wanna okay. mash? You wanna be the sure, masher? Sure, I'll be the masher. You be the masher. And you want a really good olive oil, so something that has great flavor, extra Whole virgin, body. exactly. Yeah. So. We're gonna add in some of that. You can smell the tanginess in here too. I don't know if it's uh, coming from the vinegar, or the pickles, everything. It's a little bit of everything, right? Yeah. So. Um, what you're going to do now is you have some mustard in there. Okay. Let's and okay. you have some pickles and parsley and shallots that I sliced. Oh, right. Look at those. Exactly. So throwing this all in? Throw it all in okay. there. And then the potatoes that I roasted. Okay. Ooh. And then I'm going to give you the grinders here. You're gonna put some salt and pepper. So stir that up and put some salt and pepper in there. More salt and pepper. Mm-hmm. This is fun. I was about to I say, like when we get put to work. I, I like it too. Well, I feel, and, and, and I feel honored that you trust us not Almost to screw this up. Yeah, this feels so. like I'm in Aunt Terry's kitchen and she's like, and you can do this. And you can do this. And, you can and you can do, do, do this. Yes. Oh, like and... I was enjoying this a lot. <laughs> And then it's that simple. And then you want to let it sit for a little bit. So you make it ahead. Okay. Yeah. And then let it sit. And that way, all the flavors are going to get together. And then we'll throw a little bit of uh, red wine vinegar in there, too. The pickles are going to add a little bit of flavor. Yeah. How and much would this are? Just a little drizzle. Little drizzle. That's perfect. Oh, look at that with a you song, too. <laughs> all right. And do you, you don't leave it set. Well, you say leave it set. No, don't. Leave it on, okay, keep it We're not okay. having food poisoning. We're okay. not. So what we want to do is, you want it to sit okay. for like 30 minutes. Okay. Just and then that'll so be great. So it soaks in. But if you're doing it ahead of time, you want to refrigerate it. Okay. We don't want food out for more than no. four No, you want the flavors to exactly. get used to each other. That, that's, that's it. Okay. Yeah. okay. All right. So, is this it? That is, is it. That we're is ready to eat? Style. You're ready oh, to eat right there. Oh, look at this yummy so nice, goodness. It's eggy. It's good. And then, like I said, it looks really pretty, so it's a great it dish does. to put on the on the table with your turkey. Yeah. And if you haven't gotten your turkey, if you haven't earned your free turkey, which I did, mm -hmm. but uh, it's mm. it's great. You can still get a turkey at a great price at 89 cents a pound in Pittsburgh. So um, go ahead and do that. All sorts of sizes there, and then half potato salad to go with it. This I is love this. so good, so tangy. I it love it. Nice. I love all the pop of flavors. I love the egg in there. I love the mustard. I love the vinegar too. Exactly. Yeah. It, it, it really, it really gets your taste buds going. So yeah. even if you put it out ahead of time, you know, for people to nosh on, but. I think mm -hmm. it goes great with the turkey. Ooh. Right. See, my problem is on TV, I keep wanting to have like big mouthfuls of it, and then I realize I can't talk. You know I understand. understand. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> but you know what? It means it's really good, Chef. Awesome. You know how there's like I'm egg salad sandwiches and chicken salad yeah. sandwiches? Why can't we do a potato salad? Because this would go this great. This is your great reason why you can't. Yeah. Right. There's, Put look, this on French fry sandwiches. 
That would be a great this sandwich. This would be a great bread. sandwich. Look at it. It came up right that. here. She came up with the idea. Oh, I love it. All you right, can, Chef Crystal. You can find the link by. to today's <laughs> recipe and all of Chef Crystal's creations on the Cooking Corner tab on our website, PittsburghTodayLive.com. I'm losing eggs.